Well, welcome uh, again to my YouTube channel. I am Jennifer. I am, my um, business name is Wellness with Jen. I am also bilingual and actually trilingual. So I could do these presentations for you and your families, um, either in English, in French, or in German. So en français, oder auch auf Deutsch. So, but my videos on my YouTube channel will be mostly English. So um, do not hesitate to send me a message to my email address. So um, I just created it. So just go in my description and find my email address in there. So what I wanted in this video to present to you is the power of the essential oils um, that I use. Um, and uh, so you probably know, I use the Detora, Dote doTERRA essential oils. I'm not editing these videos, so you're getting the real me here. Um, so essential oils are um, natural. So um, they are coming from the leaf, the stem, or the flower of the plant. And um, doTERRA, when they cultivate the essential oil from those plants, they do not add nor take away anything from that plant and their essential oil. Um, when we look at a magnified version of the plant, you can see there are sacks of oils attached to um, like inside stems or onto a leaf. Um, and these sacks of oils protect the plants um, against predators, um, and maybe even uh, viruses and um, bacteria, And it keeps the plant healthy. So that's why we get the same benefits when we produce the oils, extract the oils through many different methods um, for the same reason of protecting us. Uh, we have to be careful as well. The essential oil is very versatile. So um, what we know is, for example, peppermint essential oil is 50 to 70 times more potent than the plant. So once the extraction is done, the potency, the versatility of that oil is multiple, multiplied. Um, so when it's, the essential oil is also very effective. Um, we use, we know of two packs of um, the effectiveness of an essential oil. We have the medicinal way, uh, which um, targets the symptoms. And there is the natural way, which goes to the root cause of any, any, <laughs> any health issues that you encounter. Um, so if you're listening, you're right here with me. I'm assuming that you are looking at a lifestyle that is more health, um, and wellness. So that means that um, you're looking at the essential oils as the natural and versatile way versus going synthetic, uh, which could bring on also side effects um, and won't necessarily hit all the symptoms um, that you're trying to um, feel better from. Um, and they are safe. So what we need to know, there's four grades of um, essential oils, right? There's the synthetic that we really want to stay away from. Um, it can be through aerosols or a candle, the wax. Um, there is the food uh, grade. Um, that one is, um, from what I was reading, um, the, um, the, there's a bait, like there's a minimum and um, and the essential oil, the versatility and the potency is beyond that. Um, and then there's therapeutic, which you could find in um, a wellness uh, storefront. But also there is what we know as the highest standard. Hi, Anya. <laughs> is the CPTG grade, certified pure test grade. And that's beyond organic. Um, plants, we know, um, will adapt. Um, but the root compounds of an oil, of a plant actually, uh, will change. So uh, we have to um, be careful how we source them and where we source them. So that's why um, doTERRA uh, sources their essential, their plants 
their essential oils from the plants in 42 different countries um, and will research the best compounds and structure of compounds from those oils that will work the best uh, for our bodies and will produce the best um, health results. So that's why the CPTG um, um, grade uh, for safety is um, the highest standard. Um, so which way do we use these oils, right? So there's three ways. Um, there's the aromatic, so right here. Um, I am diffusing the essential oil. So that one um, will reach your lymphatic um, uh, 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 yeah, lymphatic system, um, limbic system, um, and it will uh, change your mood and will also trigger memory. So it goes through your um, nose and reaches the back of your head where your lymphatic um, system is and will cause those triggers. That's why we know that aromatically the oils will help with your mood, but it's also great to open airways. So you could put some uh, peppermint, a drop of peppermint into the palm of your hands, just to be careful. Um, don't, if it wants to come down. There we go. Whoops, I got two now. Rub your hands together. Don't go too close to your face. Don't go into your eyes because it's really potent 50 to 70 times. And breathe it in. So it opens up your airways. So it's also great for the lungs. Um, and it freshens the air. That's another reason what most people would use their essential oils for at home. But you have to remember, it's also good for the health. If your air is freshened, your health will feel better as well. That's why we open our windows in the summertime to change the air. And it's the fastest way to feel better um, and to um, uh, uh, reach those triggers. There is topically, I make my own um, roller and doTERRA sells them as well. This one is the most reachable one right now. You apply it, so it's um, diluted with um, fractionated coconut oil. You apply it to your wrist and rub it together and it creates a pure fume. Um, also with creams and facial creams and in the, um, our shampoos, our tooth, uh, toothpaste, um, these are all um, other topically um, ways to use the oil. So they, you would apply it to concerned areas and um, maybe uh, needed areas such as, you know, uh, muscle pains um, or, um, you know, digestive issues, your, your stomach. Um, so to remember where the best locations um, on your body to apply topically the oils is just remember few, F-E-W, F for feet, E for ears, so behind the ears, um, and W for the wrists. Um, then there is internally, I prepared myself a glass of water here, and I have um, lemon. Oops. So I put a drop, a drop or two, um, to two to three drops of your essential oil. Uh, to a four to six ounce glass of water. Make sure that it's glass, metal, or um, but definitely not plastic, um, or in a veggie cap uh, to take internally. Um, never ever take any essential oils internally unless they are um, certified, tested grade oils, and doTERRA, basically. Cheers. Um, so we know, and check your labels. Your labels will tell you if they can be taken internally. So now it's the time to book your free consultation with me. Um, so let's do that as soon as possible. So contact me via email or through Facebook messages. And so we can uh, make connection and, um, and start your wellness journey. So hopefully you've learned a lot with this video and comment below for more information.